In healthcare, we can use the XMR or Individuals in Moving Range chart to start to analyze things like ratios like falls per thousand patient days, bloodstream infections per thousand line days, and so on. So let's take a look at our data here. So we can use falls per thousand patient days, uh, central line days, all kinds of things can be tracked using the QI macros. Door to balloon rate is another thing we could do. Simply select your data with the, the mouse, click on the QI macros menu, and choose the control chart wizard. And it'll actually go out and calculate a range, the variability, from time period to time period. So here you can see our range of door to balloon time. And we're actually increasing the ratio of patients who are getting their door to balloon time in a, a timely fashion, OK? More of them getting it done in under 90 minutes. So this is obviously a good trend. This might actually be an interesting chart to draw using one of the QI macros tools called an XMR trend chart. And so we could actually take that. <clears throat> And this will actually plot variability as a trend. Now, obviously, once you get to 100, <clears throat> but this would show that we have a consistent ongoing increase. And I'm going to bring that up a little bit. And so we have a useful fit of our line. So we've been increasing uh, our rate of patients who are getting 90 minute door to balloon time. So the XMR charts can assist you in demonstrating what's going on and how it's working. And from there, you can start to continue to say, we need to continue to improve, or we need to reduce this or enhance that. The XMR chart is a very powerful tool in the QI macros.